Hello and welcome back to the NatWest Business Show. I'm your host, Angelica Bell, and this season we've got more enterprising business owners with inspiring stories of startups, struggles and successes. And today's guest embodies this to a T. Sharmadine Reed is a powerhouse. She's the founder of War Nails and more recently the Stack World, which looks to level the playing field with gender equity, particularly in the world of business. Sharmadine's success is testament to her incredible hard work, determination and genuine passion, which has led her to become a widely revered person in business. If you want to build a business with purpose, get ready for an amazing chat. Sharmadine, welcome. Hi. How are you doing? I'm really well, thank you. Looking forward to hearing your story. But the first thing we ask our guests to do is to come with a confession. So maybe a moment of failure that helped shape you or a business blunder that you found invaluable. So spill the beans. My business confession is so embarrassing. It's actually what I would always refer to as a rookie rookie mistake this okay. is a rookie error so something you did at the start of your business. no 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 I did it not at the start of my business <laughs> but I would call it a rookie error okay. <laughs> or when I'm saying to my friends I'm like that's rookie behavior um which is we let the credit card expire on our domain for our main website so we had a website beautystack.com in our hosting, you know, it was renewing every year. And then the credit card expired and nobody checked. And then we lost the domain to a company abroad who was clearly had their eyes on it. We were all like, no, what is happening? And then they tried to sell it back to us for like a lot of money. And I said, no, I said no, because we were at a transition point of the business of switching from one company name to another. And I thought, OK, if I'm to look at the silver lining of this, maybe this is a sign. Maybe this is a sign to truly let go, mm. be zen about it. Whenever there is a problem or a blunder or a rookie mistake, as I call it, I try and look for the upside or the silver lining. And, you know, thankfully we were transitioning our business but if I had not been that would have been catastrophic a that very very been. expensive mistake. yeah exactly so luckily you had sort of backup otherwise it could have been mm -mm. definitely I mean anyone who is starting a business you know one of the first things you would want to do is trademark IP get your domain names etc but we also buy alternative domain names provided they're cheap so not only the main company name but maybe the .co.uk .com .london or whatever it is um, just a handful of alternatives to use as backup is always a good idea so you've given some advice there <laughs> with your blunder <laughs> learning advice. always learn exactly. from your mistakes <laughs> 